Hello and welcome to South Park, the fractured but whole. Jake in the bushes. Today we're continuing our superhero misadventures. Someone has decimated the Freedom Pals franchise. How are we gonna make our money if our movie series doesn't work out chronologically? We need to go to a death store riddle. Need to solve one, I mean. I don't even remember what it was. Where's our journey? Journal. Oh, the cemetery, the police station. But Lord, it's me, buddy. A place where death comes in all shapes and sizes? What, what could it mean? We've got to solve this riddle. Take down Connor together and prove our innocence. And hey, thanks for being the only one who believes in me. Hey, new kid. I've been following what's going on. I'm trying to pinpoint Cartman's location. For now, just do what he says so he doesn't get suspicious. Freedom Pals, this is Super Craig. No sign of Cartman at the park. No sign of Cartman at Raisins either. Mosquito, stay on point. Get out of there. Where there's crime, there's Call Girl. Super Kid, attack power! Fast Pass springs into action. Bloody fuck! Freedom Pal or Coon Friend, you're cool in my book, new kid. I am like mountain... Call Girl is online! <laughs> Say cheese! Ninja power is not possible! Warrior spirit... Turn erased. Tupperware, keeping it fresh. The predator finds its prey. The ninja is so him. Time to move. Healing in 0.3 seconds. Of money back. This ought to do the trick. Glad to be working with you, new kid. This. I think he just won the internet call, girl. Executing combat protocol. Copper tornado warning. Oh, yeah. Up. I'm all revved up and ready. You test my reserve. 
I'm about ready to detonate. Oh, ha! <laughs> what a pathetic investment. Keeping it fresh, victoriously. Come to this shop to see what your prize is. South Park has a lot of shops, but which one involves death? Fight now! Fight or we don't get... Gokcha's a Junbi! Dishonorable coward! Dorawa, Tony Pirada go! Fight now! We ninja Got some new inventory. There's still hope we can make you less monstrous. Give Stan a hug for me. Death in all shapes and sizes, like like some kind of weapon store? We have to stick up for oppressed pretty girls everywhere. Off on our journey, bullied you by want ninjas, some of this, Forthy? sixth graders, raisins girls. How much hate does a simple fourth grader have to endure? Soja, kopjengi nonde, kopjengi. You solved my riddle, huh? You're not as dumb as I thought. You see the guy standing over there? Take a selfie with him. Do it now, your mom is gonna suffer. Crime fighting's not a game, vigilante. You're gonna get somebody killed. <laughs> you're getting close, new kid. But to find me, you're gonna have to solve one more riddle. I am a place where seats hang from chains. Part desert, part jungle, where happiness reigns. Got some new gear in stock, butthole. It's your lucky day. Catch you later.
전한다. 돌아와. 돈이 필요하다고. <웃음> I'm guessing it's the swing sets at the park. Sea tanger, chains, desert, forest, and rain. I don't know. I can't teleport, so I'm guessing the game's just gonna make me run back and forth all over the you map. Want some of this, Forthy? Dodging ninjas. That's what I thought. You want an autographed Raisins Girl calendar, sweetie? Come get it! I'm a place where seats hang from chains, part desert, part jungle, where happiness reigns. What could it mean? Chaos is ready to rumble. How did you solve my riddle? God, you're so smart. Wow, I'm so jelly. All right, you see that woman there? Go talk to her. He... He told me if I didn't do what he said, he'd do horrible things to my patio. Get a selfie with her. Do it now! I'm sorry. He, he said he would poop on my patio. What was I supposed to do? We just cleaned our patio. I had to do what he said. He told me if I didn't do what he said, he'd do horrible things to my patio. Can't get it. I need that. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> that should just about do it. Sorry, kid. I have what I need now. See you around. Think you can quell our chaos, fool? That's right, kid. Hit the bricks. New kid, I got him. All of his messaging has been coming from the community center. You heard it, Freedom Pals! Everyone get to the community center now! Hey, Forthy, come play with us big kids! <laughs> Need to get somewhere fast, new kid? Catch you later. Where's everyone else? Doesn't matter. There's no time. Let's get this fat turd while we can. All right. One, two, three. <gasps> oh, my God. Look. Where, where, where? If it isn't the Freedom Pals and their newest recruit. What have you done with the new kid's parents, fat ass? Nothing yet. But when I'm finished with you, I can't say they'll be exactly safe. This has gone far enough. We end it now. The only thing about to end is you, Mysterio. We aren't gonna fight you, Carmen. Now put your stupid hand down and stop playing games. We have to stop him, you guys. He's got all the new kid's followers now. Even with their help, you can't stop me, King. We'll see about that, motherfucker. All right, Cartman. You want us to kill Mitch Connor? We'll fucking kill him. <laughs> We can stop Mitch Connor, guys. Just try not to hit me. And now you see me? Oh, dude, why are you attacking me? Sorry, your parents got kidnapped, but Lord, I can totally relate as a kidnapped victim myself. How stupid do you think we are, Eric? How stupid do you think we are, Eric? God, cowgirl, you're so annoying. Your muscular body makes the most effective human shield, Kuhn. I am known for my super strength, you son of a bitch. Ah! 
cartoon friends don't seem very friendly towards you now, Keen. Just shut up, Connor. Time anomaly detected. I think I deserve another turn after that. Hey, that's not fair! <laughs> oh, damn it, I didn't kidnap Butler's parents! Oh, come on! I'm on your side yet? Did somebody call for call girl? Honing in on the signal. Oh, ah, just look at the loyalty you inspire in your former comrades. You're the one being a dick to them. Here. Fuck you, fat ass. I have a really good feeling about this, guys. <clears throat> guys, I'm really sorry about this. Mitch is such an asshole, huh? Oh, yes, that's gonna add gross out. This is really bubbing me out. This isn't very funny, Coom. Do I look like I'm laughing? Name, so it didn't count. Deflector shield. Right, bitch, you dead. <laughs> I'm rubber, you're glue. Yeah, I went back to him, huh? I was on. Time to take out the trolls. Yes, I'm just gonna do it. We'll damage him. You seem to be taking all the damage. Yeah, because these guys can't aim. Now it's my turn. Engage. Jumper tornado. Yeah. Hey, that was me. Watch the friendly fire. You're only hurting yourself. Ah. Time to spread some rabies. <laughs> you know I didn't do that, right? That was Connor. Yeah, right, that afflicts burning, too. Better hurry. Ow! Can't you see Mitch is using his human shield? Ah! Get ready for the call girl, haters. Over there! I'm about to bring it! No, no, no! Welcome to Coon Town. Damn it, Connor! Stop hurting my friends! Friends? What friends? Okay, and you're chilled.
That chills you too. Avert your eyes, children. The coon is about to get into some adult situations. <laughs> you superheroes bleed so easily. Don't taunt my friends, dude. That afflicts burning, too. The flash mob is just a tweet away. Bring it! You did it, guys! You beat Mitch Carter! Where are they? Where are the new kid's parents? <laughs> You'll never know. Carter, no! Shit, he's gone! Come on! We're taking this fat piece of shit back to base! What fat piece of shit, human cat? The only way we're going to get Carmen to talk is to torture him. Yeah, sometimes torture is the only answer. You're gonna torture me? For what? Everyone get back to Freedom Pal's base. We have to make this shithead talk. What are you talking about? Guys, it's me, the Keen! What the- <clears throat> Looks like the Coon is either having an identity crisis or he has a parasite in his hand. A lot of people seem to be supporting Mitch. That's not good. Torturing the coon. We need your help. Come to Freedom Palace base. Say diabetes? Well, one diabetes rage coming up. I fulfilled my duty, and now I must depart. This new Freedom Pals crew sounds like quite an accomplished group of superheroes. We shall enslave you another day, such as tomorrow, customer! That's it, butthole. You found every fast travel station. Prepare for tremendous convenience watching, as you... And I believe we can help each other. <laughs> fast travel Have you heard of the super best friends? Well, it is I, Sea Man. 
a powerful superhero with the amazing ability to talk to fish and swim. It's Seaman! That sea man! It is my job to help all creatures of the sea. And right now, there is a gay fish who wants help getting his mother into heaven. I want to help the little gay fish, but all the other super best friends keep saying they're too busy. Will you help? Then swim down to the water's depth with me. Don't worry, my water defenses shall protect you. And so, the new kid dives down through the water, protected by seamen. Seaman! Down to where the little gay fish makes his home. Boo-hoo-hoo! Oh, boo-hoo-hoo, boo-hoo, boo-hoo! Do not cry, little fish! I have returned and with help! Oh, thank you, seaman! You really think you can help my mom get to heaven? It's seaman, and yes, I do! This child has incredible powers! All right, if you get my mom into heaven, I will give you three million dollars and some jewelry. Just touch my little gay flipper, and we shall be magically transported to help her! Touching the gay fish's flipper, Seaman and his sidekick are transported to Valhalla, where another fish rides a unicorn. I'm here, Mama! Is that you, baby? It's me! We're gonna get you to heaven, Mama! Just hold on! This kid's gonna help us! Okay, baby! Whatever you say, you little gay fish! And so, Seaman's sidekick had to help the gay fish's mom fly to heaven on a stream of rainbow unicorn farts. That sea man again. This road leads right to heaven, Ma. Just watch out for those columns. Oh, no. We should put this whole event on a gold disc and send it into space so that aliens can see it. But even as the gay fish's mom got closer to heaven, the path became more treacherous. This is one of the most amazing things of all time. Of all time! Uh-oh, you're going so fast. I'll just get to heaven quicker, baby! Gay Fish's mom was nearly to the outskirts of heaven, but then Zazul appeared. Oh no, that demon represents all my haters! These fireballs are like the mean tweets people send at me because they don't understand my genius. Damn you, Zazul! You're dead! And so, Seaman's sidekick had to help the Gay Fish's mom fly to heaven on a stream of rainbow unicorn farts. That's Sea Man, again! This road leads right to heaven, Ma. Just watch out for those columns. I like that we have more lives now. This is so exciting. <laughs> but even as the gay fish's mom got closer to heaven, the path became more treacherous. No one's ever seen shit like this before. You think this shit's regular? Uh-oh, you're going so fast. I'll just get to heaven quicker, baby. We're blowing minds up in here. The gay fish's mom was nearly to the outskirts of heaven, but then Zazul appeared. Oh, no, that demon represents all my haters. These fireballs are like the mean tweets people send at me because they don't understand my genius. Hold it on a gold disc and send it into space so that aliens can see it. Damn it, dude. <laughs> and so, Seaman's sidekick had to help the gay fish's mom fly to heaven on a stream of rainbow unicorn farts. That sea man, again. This road leads right to heaven, Ma. Watch out for those columns. Ma, your journey to heaven is probably the greatest work of art I've ever done. But even as the gay fish's mom got closer to heaven, the path became more treacherous. We're blowing minds up in here. Uh-oh, you're going so fast. I'll just get to heaven quicker, baby. No one's ever seen shit like this before. You think this shit's regular? The gay fish's mom was nearly to the outskirts of heaven, but then Zazul appeared. Oh no, that demon represents all my haters. These 
fireballs are like the mean tweets people send at me because they don't understand my genius. This is so exciting. Oh man, this has everything. Columns, fireballs, sparkle rainbow, genius. I made it! Thanks for your help, baby! I love you, mama! Baby. Yep, I'll see you soon, Ma Wait, what the fuck is that supposed to mean? Mama! Hold on a sec. What is that? You have done very well, my child. Thank you, Jesus. Not you, Seaman. The kid. Seaman! Oh, yeah, right. Anyway, you had no reason to help this little gay fish, my child. And yet, you did. Kid had every reason to help me. I'm a lyrical genius, voice of a generation. I see that you are trying to determine your spirituality, my child. Allow me to help thee. There are good and bad in every religion, my child. Which are you? Lawful. Neutral. Chaotic. Lawful. Neutral. Chaotic. Neutral. Agnostic. Wiccan. Buddhist. Agnostic. Buddhist. Buddhist. Okay, you're a neutral Buddhist. Oh wait, I bet you want a selfie with Jesus, right? Congratulations, my child. You know who you are now. You are one step closer to believing in yourself. Good luck, my little neutral Buddhist. Well, well, well. Look at what we've got here. We've got ourselves a cisgender. Heterosexual, white, American, neutral, Buddhist. Dang, Cletus, why are you talking like that? Dialogue tree. Oh, I got you. We don't take kindly to your types around here. Let's welcome this thing to our town. You're making a big mistake messing with us. Let's make this quick. Now you see me? Ow, I ain't turning the other cheek. My god's a vengeful god and he told me to fuck you up. Yeah. Glad to be working with you, new kid. Target acquired and damage recorded. I'm gonna beat you straight. It's the only way. I'm anomaly detected. I'm gonna teach you the gospel of kicking your ass. This ought to cast out your demons. Make way for call girl. No password is too complex for call girl. <laughs> they put a hex on me. Much better. Everyone try to keep up. Yes. <laughs> you fucking believer of stuff different than me. Yeah, you ain't converting me to your slightly different beliefs. or get your ass kicked, socialist. You're gonna need some faith-based counseling after this. Brutal. Maybe now you'll care more about encryption. Engage, temper tornado. Ugh. Getting a little dizzy here. 
I'm all revved up and ready. prayers to whatever you say your prayers to. Congrats, super friends. This feels like a good time for a mobbing. Go towards the light pole. Somebody call for a fast pass? Better run fast. There you go. What is wrong with you guys? I am not your enemy! You're gonna talk, Cartman. New kid, you're going to have to make Cartman talk. What? What are you gonna do with that? You guys are wasting your time. I'm the Coon. Torture doesn't work against me, remember? So, so what? I, I just have to watch you eat? Is that it? I'm, I'm not afraid. Broccoli? I, I'm not afraid of broccoli. It gets a bad rap if you ask me. See? It, it doesn't even phase me. This is a waste of time. We should be going after the bad guy. No, oh, fuck. Not, no, not even a little bit. I can gobble those farts up, see? Yum, 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 yum. This is a waste of time. We should be going after the bad guy. Oh, no, 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 Hit him again. Oh, geez. Well, I, I guess we're done here, huh? Can someone reach around and get this knot? Well, actually, the asparagus might taste better with my vomit. <laughs> oh, now that's pretty gross, you guys. Oh, God. Yeah, you guys might as well give up. They're not... <laughs> oh, no. oh, oh, wait, 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 you guys. Oh, my God. Oh, the, the cats. What cats? I just remembered. C Connor. I think the, the fudge jarred my memory. The, he said something about making cats more powerful than... The, the, yeah, that's it. He must, he must want to genetically alter the cats. The genetics lab, Dr. Mephesto. Yes, that must be it, guys. <laughs> go to the genetics lab at the top of the hill. <clears throat> I wonder what's up there. I'm the f f fastest kid in town. Getting ready for dinner, but I've invested in this story. Catch you later.
All right, the new kid's here. Come on, new kid. Can I help you? Yeah, hi. We signed up for the tour. Ah, uh, yes, the night tour, correct? Uh, yeah, we're a little early. Well, I'm afraid for safety purposes, the tours are only offered from 10 p.m. to midnight. What, just to be extra spooky? It'll be worth the wait, my friends. See you tonight. Shit. Well, now what do we do? We'll just have to wait. We can't afford to let anyone else go in or out of this gate. I agree. We're just gonna have to wait here till nighttime. Okay, how far away is that? Uh, about six hours. All right, just wait six hours and we're good to go. How long now? Still about six hours. Okay, cool. This sure is gonna be exciting in six hours. Shut up, Scott. Did anybody bring any uh, snacks or anything? Yeah, we should have brought snacks. Oh, God, okay, how long now? Right around six hours still. Jesus, fuck. You know, kid, you still have yet to tap the full potential of your time-bending ass. 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 Something that could enhance your ability could possibly make time pass more quickly. 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 You see that AC fan over there? Right there, behind you. Over by the gate. On the left side. Can't miss it. If you fart into that fan, the oscillation of the gas will filter it through the expansion valve, mixing it with the pressurized refrigerant inside the condenser coils. coils. Don't question if that makes any sense, kid. Just fart in the fan. Come on. I'll fire it up for you right now. Some young people interested in genetic engineering, huh? Wonderful, please come in. Oh, hello. Oh, there's more. Hello, sir. My, my, there's a lot of you. Come on! Well, I'm so pleased that you children are interested in genetic engineering. Genetic science began as a simple question. Can a monkey be made to have four asses instead of one? The answer was yes. And now we've been able to give more asses to pigs, horses, everything you can imagine. Yes, little boy. How did that help? Oh, you're one of the cynics, huh? Well, meet me over here for the tour and I'll show you how. Come on, don't be shy. We don't want to miss the four ass gorilla feeding. Please have a seat. You ever play that video game Half-Life? Okay, here we go. Here you can see our greenhouse. Genetic engineering is helpful to grow larger tomatoes, onions, cucumbers. Fruits and vegetables with more asses means more nutrition for people all around the planet. What good does that do? Oh, you Bible thumpers are all alike. Don't play God, you'll pay for it. <laughs> Let's continue up to the second level, shall we? Another benefit of genetic science, of course, is combining animals. Like these donkey apes, bunny fish, squirrel donkeys, and more. Once we put more asses on these, we will truly be benefiting science. Will you please explain how that benefits science at all? What's your name, little boy? Super Craig. You see, Super Craig, once we know how to do things to animals, we can hopefully apply them to mankind. You think having more asses is impossible? I tell you it's not. You see, genetic engineering is not just for animals and veggies. We are working towards helping people as well. Here you can see genetic mutations of my dead son. Most people don't remember that I once had a young child named Terence. 
Oh yeah, I remember that kid. I was wondering whatever happened to him. Terence was killed tragically in town when some kids were playing around with a relic belonging to Barbara Streisand. Oh, jeez, I think that was us. So, you're doing this all as a way to bring back your dead son? Bring him back? Well, of course not. I'm trying to give his dead body more asses so he can finally rest in peace. Now let's continue on to the fourth floor. Oh, fuck. Well, here we are. The top floor of the building and the end of our tour. What are these? These horrible, monstrous mistakes of science. Our new benefactor has asked that we genetically alter some of the local sixth graders and make them stronger and crazier. Okay, okay. Why the fuck would you do that? How do you mean? Why the fuck would you make genetically enhanced sixth graders? Calm down, Super Craig. How do you think we pay for all this? We have financial donors. Our latest benefactor has asked for this army of mutated sixth graders to protect his altered cats. What altered cats? Oh, right over this way. A wealthy benefactor named Mr. Connor has donated money to have stray cats enhanced with more asses. Our company can add asses to things at very competitive rates. The problem is that cats seem to become really aggressive when given more asses. They've proven to be quite deadly. Then why would you bring a bunch of kids up here? Look, there's nothing to worry about. This entire facility has a very complex security grid. Huh, that's never happened before. Oh shit, someone shut down the security grid. What do you mean? <laughs> Hello, Freedom Pals. What are you doing, fat ass? So, you figured out my little plan, huh, Freedom Pals? Think you can stop me? Oh, I have someone here who'd like to say hello, new kid. Go on, talk. Guys? Guys, it's me, the kid. Will you knock it off? Listen to me. Don't make any deals with this piece of garbage. He's an animal. Ah! That's enough out of you, kid. You've been a real pain in my ass, new kid. You should have known not to mess with Mitch Connor. Where the fuck are you? Mr. Connor, if you shut down the security grid, then everyone in this building is going to die. What? Sorry, Doc. Sometimes sacrifices have to be made for the greater good of the city. So long, Freedom Pals. I'm sorry, kid, but we're probably all going to die here. Son of a bitch, that hurts! We've got a cat on an attack vector. Time to move. <laughs> Freedom Pal or Coon Friend, you're cool in my book, new kid. My turn. <laughs> Say cheese! <laughs> I captured the exact moment I split your lip. <laughs> I'll avenge you, call girl. I can avenge myself, thanks. Program for etiquette protocol and kicking ass. These things are so bitey and scratchy. I'm anomaly detected. Those kitties look kind of cute, but they're not. I definitely should not have hit that button. Fast pass. Call girl is making a house call. Amazing. We may actually survive. No. Maybe if I just press buttons randomly? Oh, I think this is it. Oh, no, I just let more cats out. You can test subjects. Assault imminent. 
Ignore the haters, call girl. I feel I should mention that my test subjects have a crazed hunger for human flesh. Might have something to do with the ass-adding process. enemies at max speed. Yeah. So, yeah, yeah, that might have messed up the other generator. Well done. But I'm afraid you're still hopelessly outassed. You're gonna hate me for this. And send. There. Now the internet knows your address, your inseam, and your nut allergy. So much trouble now. Aggressor is neutralized. I did the same thing as last time, and the result was indeed the same. Fascinating. Uh oh, it appears I've released more test subjects. It's my turn to get fresh. is on the starting blocks. Healing in 0.3 seconds with your money back. Thanks. <laughs> Detect the loss, but how? I'm mad because I was going to try and heal everyone before freaking he died. Use that buff, baby. Oops, I think I just did something bad to the generator. I'm about ready to detonate some social media accounts.
My poor creatures. We must escape the lab. Maybe. Maybe we can go through some of the larger exhibits. This way, children. You know, I'm not sure this panel actually opens the door at all. The mutant sixth graders are on the loose. This was definitely not supposed to happen. <laughs> School's so dumb. Parents are dumb. Yeah, adults are stupid. Oh, Jesus. It's okay. We'll be safe in the tour tram. Oh, the tour tram is offline. Somebody's gonna have to get to the CPU and hit the override switch. Where's the CPU? Down on the third level. Oh, it was silly to put it there, wasn't it? So somebody has to walk down to the third level and flip the switch? One, two, three, not it, not it, not, not, it. It. not it, not it, not it, not it, not it. Sorry, new kid, but it really should be you anyway. Yeah, if you think about it, this is all kind of your fault. All right, we're stuck in the genetics lab. A whole bunch of many-ass creatures. I think I'm gonna end that one there. Come back when I'm a little more motivated. I am getting hungry. My name is Jake in the Bushes. If you guys are enjoying this playthrough, let me know. Make sure to try and enjoy your day. Yeah, with this game is well, single player. I don't know whether to just like sit here and him. talk to myself, but it seems to have a compelling story, so I just kind of let it play out. See you later.